Modern inventions like cell phones, email, and wireless internet access have improved communication. However, they have also trapped us in a digital maze. As we spend more time caught up in the artificial world, we lose touch with the simplicity and peacefulness of nature. Many people longing for a simpler life have turned to the writings of Henry David Thoreau. Thoreau was born in the small town of Concord, Massachusetts in 1817. His parents knew the nearby forest well, and they would take him out to study the birds and flowers. Thus, he developed a deep connection with his natural surroundings from an early age. When he wasn't outside enjoying nature, Thoreau read books. His academic interests led him to enroll at Harvard. As a student, Thoreau studied a wide range of topics. Instead of satisfying him, Thoreau's education only increased his natural curiosity about the world around him. After graduation, Thoreau joined his family's pencil manufacturing business, but he felt there must be more to life. At the age of 28, he moved to a place near the shore of Walden Pond, built a cabin, and withdrew from modern life. Thoreau lived by a motto of simplicity. He spent very little money and kept few possessions. Most of his days were spent observing the wonders of nature. Every element of nature became precious to him. While living in solitude for two years, Thoreau wrote the book Walden. In it, he vividly describes Walden Pond's beauty and discusses his spiritual connection with nature. Thoreau continued to study nature and record his thoughts until his death at the age of 44. During his lifetime, Thoreau's work was not well received. Like many creative geniuses, he was ahead of his time. In Walden, Thoreau wrote, The mass of men lead lives of quiet desperation. Through his writings, Thoreau has helped many to understand their connection with nature and to avoid the desperation of modern life. <laughs>